You're thinking about her again, aren't you? Who? Yeah. You know who. You've been thinking of her a lot lately. If I was thinking of a certain party, and I won't say I was, I might be thinking I... I didn't treat her well. I might be thinking what I did to her was mean. And she might be sad or lonely or desperate because of it. I might be thinking all that if I was thinking anything at all. Damn. <sighs> Why now? I'm happy. Maybe I don't deserve to be. She hadn't crossed my mind until recently, and now she won't go away. Not like Jim. He went away. I often wonder where he got to. I ain't sorry he's gone, though. <laughs> you never asked me who she is. I don't want to know. You loved her, I suppose. I thought so once, but now I don't know. Would it put you out too much if I went off for a couple of days? I can manage. I'll ask only one thing. Don't do to me what you did to her. If you're not coming back, Right, and tell me. I wouldn't want to spend the rest of my days wondering if every passing stranger might be you at last. Table. My sister's been cleaning up. The tea room's a bit upset. Miriam likes a good turnout. Is her way? Polly Larkin. And who's your name? I'm Larkin. My sister married Mr. Polly. She's a widow now, though. That's been these past three years. Widow? He was found drowned in the Medway. My poor sister wouldn't have known him if it hadn't been for the name sewn in his clothes. All white and eaten away he was. Well, there must have been an inquest. Yeah, of course. He drowned, that's all. You sure it was him? Well, who else could it have been? In the very clothes he wore? <sighs> must have been a shock to your sister. She's not the type to give up. Of course, she had the life insurance. I suppose she did. We started the tea rooms with it. I've got to get some milk. Dissolute type, was he, this Polly? Not dissolute, exactly. He was a very wearing sort of husband. Feeble's the word. Weak. Weak as water. Not as weak as you think, Annie. What's that? I said me tea. I don't like it weak. Isn't it, Miriam? It's you. 
No, no it isn't. He, he just looks like me. I knew all along that drowned man wasn't you. I tried to think it was. I tried to think the water perhaps had altered your wrists and your feet and the colour of your hair. I was always afraid you'd come back. How we'll repay the insurance, I don't know. No, Miriam, listen. I haven't come back. I'm not coming back. Uh, think of me as a visitor from another world. You're not coming back? How can I? When I'm dead. Look, you, you shut up about me and I'll shut up about myself. I only came back because I thought you might be hard up and in trouble. I thought you might be unhappy. And that things weren't finished between us, but, but now I see how things are. I'm, I'm satisfied. I'm going to abscratulate, see? Hey, presto. Back into thin air. I don't think you're ever going to see me again because you ain't. And we'll both be happier for it. about a ghost. Well, he's a rumman, isn't he? Soups. Do you find any reason why you shouldn't? None at all. Are you going to marry my mother? Not marry. As good as. You didn't scope? No. 